start you off with just a basic introduction on how to actually create an animation. And if you really want to see a nice one, they give you a sample one here, this Mega Man picture. You can just click on that and it'll show you um, an already created sprite with three frames. But I'll, I'll create one uh, for you real quick here as well. There's also some other um, great tutorials you can use right from the site here. But I'll go to create a sprite. If you're going to want to save these locally on their, or um, I'm sorry, save these to the Piscal site, you're going to need to create a login. And you can just use your Gmail account. Um, settings for the size here can be set up before you begin. I would recommend doing it beforehand. Um, look at what some other um, sprites are sized at to give you an idea. I'm just going to do something very simple here, just like a little smiley face that blinks. Uh, so I'm going to get a, a yellow color, yellowish color, and I'm going to draw out my circle. You'll notice that the circle is very choppy right now, right? If I want to make that a bigger, smoother size, I can change my pixel dimensions. So let's say I do it at 200 by 200, and you'll see the difference now. Um, resize it, and I go to draw it out. You see those... Um, the resolution is improving as I create a larger size. So I drew my circle. You'll notice it's outlined in yellow. I want to fill it with that same yellow color. Great. Let's next um, create the smiley face portion, the bottom part. I'm going to change my color here to black and draw a horrible smiley face. Okay. That's okay. That's just okay. Now the face is on one layer. This is going to stay the same the whole time. So I'm going to name this layer. I'm going to go to my layer one and you can actually um, change the name of each layer. I'm going to change this one to face. I'm going to make a new one here. I already did. It's called layer two, but I'm going to change the name of this to eyes. And so on this first layer, I'm just going to draw some normal eyes. Let's get white for a color. Okay, you can swap around these colors if you want to switch out the colors. I'll draw my eyeballs. Amazing, amazing eyeballs there. Okay, let's do... Another one here. That's kind of funny looking. So you'll notice it highlights just the um, top layer. So if you want to, the layer that you have selected, um, you can toggle it out to preview just that individual layer. But it highlights the layer so that you know which one you're working on and editing. So right now I just have a face. There's no animation going on. Um, let's say I just want these eyes to blink once. So I'm going to copy this frame. And now on this new frame, I will change the eyeballs. So I'm going to the eyeball layer. Really, I just want these completely gone. So I'm going to get rid of the eyes layer on just this frame. So I'm actually, what I'll do is I'll probably just erase it. It looked like when I went and deleted it, it erased them from all of the frames, which I didn't want to do. So I'll just quickly erase this one. Um, you could also make a selection and just cut it away too. There's a lot of ways you can edit. And you'll see now my um, preview is going crazy because in my new frame, I don't have any eyes. So it's changing. And you can change the way how quickly that animates. What I want to do here is just draw some straight lines now. Like he's closing his eyes. <laughs> okay. Excuse the poor drawing. I'm using my little trackpad here on my on my Mac. But now you'll see his eyes are closing, animating. Let's say I don't like the location of some of this stuff. You can easily move things. Try and get it lined up a little bit better. Okay, so you can make it faster or slower. 
but now you can see that animation action. So this is obviously just a very simple and uh, easy animation, but just to show you how the process works, um, once you are ready to start creating your sprite, hopefully this will help you out.